Hi YouTube, this is also X for CCXBits.com and today on CCXBits we'll be unboxing the Pulsar PQ2003 digital watch that we got today. This is also a piece of history because Pulsar, the brand name, they were the first manufacturer to ever release a digital watch. They were the first to release a digital watch, an electronic watch and an LED watch back in 1972. Later on the Pulsar brand, the company was acquired by Seiko and they still make watches today. Most of their watches are analog but they have this digital watch right here that we're unboxing. As you can see it's, that's the box. It's uh, very modern and elegant at the same time. It says Pulsar on the front with white letters on top of a blue background. The box itself is white. And this watch is a little bit of a throwback to their first digital watch of 72. As we'll see once we get it out of the box. Now the detail package is pretty simple, pretty elegant. Let's open the box and see what we have here. And we can see the watch with a little pouch with this, this cushion, this little uh, uh, pillow here, it is silver, it has three buttons and it looks, three buttons on the right and two buttons on the left, it looks a little bit like the original digital watch that Pulsar released in 72, because it's silver, it's metal sides, it's inverted screen, it's a black background with um, transparent digits. But it's a full digital screen, so it's not stationary, it can move. You can see the tag, this is the retail tag where the price will go if you were to the retail. We're checking out the instructions manual now, with the Pulsar brand in it. How to use the watch, it's pretty straightforward though, it's like a, like a smart watch, it's pretty easy to use. Plus the screen is very intuitive because it shows you the graphically it has uh, animations. So this is the warranty and registration and all that stuff. The box is blue on the inside. There's nothing else on the box there and the cover is white. It's live. It's a little slogan. Let's take a look at the watch itself. It says it's a very screen, it says Pulsar on it, it has a circle, it's, a, it's a, the color black, it's painted black it's, as well as on the sides on top of the silver, I mean below the silver uh, buttons. Let's take the tag out. Let's strap and let's see the back of the watch, it has a logo, it has the model number etc a bit more information in there when it was made stuff like that okay it says it displays the day of the week the date the time of course and the month let's just strap in let's let's put this the watch on the wrist and this is how it looks this place Min hour, minutes, and seconds. Settings. Let's go. Let's go to most time because chronograph, world times, alarm, timer. It says chronograph already, and then we can change the time and the settings with the, these keys. This is back and forward, and the middle. The, the key in the middle is the LED light, the LED backlight. This is forward, backwards. And like you said, it has animation that can be disabled on in settings. You have the keys as mode and uh, chrono timer to be instantaneous. That's the regular display. The light, it's a uh, orange right now the LED light if you see there you can change that in settings to a blue LED light please say forward plus it has it says mode it says uh, it has uh, 
it starts all the keys adjust start stop which is forward a reset which is back and then the key with the little dot in it that's the led light as you can see it says the year 2018 the date the specific date with month and day the time hours minutes and seconds and the day of the week it will also show you whether you have an alarm or not let's take a closer look at the watch and the details of its the craftsmanship basically of it you can see pulls are on top it has some lines to give you an idea of the of the of the time in a circle which you don't really need in this watch because it's, it doesn't have the close and then there, there you see the LED, the blue led light the blue led backlight but it doesn't have the option for um, clock hands so it's all digital you can go to settings real quick to show you that and it's basically silver and the straps are rubber and there's they, the whole watch has a really good feel to it it has a really nice weight to it you see that yet you're wearing a really really good timepiece echo mode lcd contrast you can change that and the led color is using the blue color key sound alarm sounds schedule sound the animation you can turn it off and on i prefer it on because it shows you have the digital display and that's really good it's a pretty pretty well equipped watch it has all of the features you will want on a watch Because look at the keys at the buttons on the side, you see it has accent, black accents or maybe titanium gray accents. It's very uh, dark gray on top of the silver finish, the chrome finish that you can see it, it shines. It's very bright. And like I said before, it's, it's it weights. So it has a really nice weight to it. Let's add it to our collection of watches. Add it to our case. The Pulsar PQ 2003 parent company Seiko makers of the first ever digital watch maybe the start of the smartwatch I would say that it's added to the collection this was also X for 00x.com or zxbits.com thank you for watching peace and I'm out